How an industrial boiler works. An industrial boiler's job is simple. Turn water into steam for use in industrial processes. The process starts with a water storage tank near the boiler. High pressure feed water pumps transfer water from the tank into the boiler shell. One pump runs while a standby pump is kept ready. A check valve prevents hot water from flowing back to the tank. Inside the boiler shell, a water level probe monitors levels. Low, high, very low, and very high. At low level, the pump starts. At high level, it stops. Very low or high levels trigger alarms and shut down the boiler. Operators can also check two sight glasses for a visual reading. Once filled, heating begins. A diesel burner, with its own fuel pump and blower, mixes fuel and air, ignited by an electronic spark to create a steady flame. Fuel is drawn from a diesel tank through a filter, and unused fuel returns via a return line. The flame never touches the water directly. Instead, it burns inside a furnace chamber, built into the boiler shell. Heat flows from the furnace into a network of tubes surrounded by water. This large contact surface makes boiling efficient, while keeping water and combustion gases completely separate. Exhaust gases exit through a chimney. Steam forms above the water line and is released to the process through a manual valve. The boiler's pressure is controlled automatically. A transmitter monitors steam pressure, and the control system turns the burner on or off to stay within limits. Mechanical safety valves act as a backup. If pressure rises above the set limit, they open to release steam. Over time, minerals from the water settle inside the boiler. To remove them, the drain valve is opened several times a day for a few seconds in a process called blowdown. All operations are overseen by a PLC control panel. It manages startup, shutdown, and load, constantly adjusting for safe, efficient, and consistent performance. And that's how an industrial boiler works, from water feed to heating to safe controlled steam production.